what's happening guys Stella crew here with another duplication glitch all right so we're gonna give this a whirl this is our first time trying this uh, legitly step by step I've tried a couple different variations of it already and it looks like you have to follow the rules exactly so founder is Tudo Facile France as usual the guy is awesome at finding these duplication glitches so big shout out to him all right so a few things you need to get started is you do need a CEO office and fill it up with some stock elegies okay um, so it cannot be a fully upgraded elegy already so if you've already chained it over to a custom elegy um, basically um, you have to start from scratch so you have to do the physical upgrade okay so make sure you have your garage full of elegies and it must also have a mod shop and you do need a friend to help you in this session as well and it must be a private session so it does not work in a public lobby so start up an invite only session invite your friend fill up your CEO office no with elegies take one of your elegies into the mod shop and we're gonna fully upgrade this right now so you do need a bit of money to get this going so we're gonna fully upgrade it okay so we'll just kinda go through this quick and we'll just kinda fully customize it we can always uh, change it later alright we're doing this just for the money so once we're doing this um, we're gonna have a friend start up a job okay and so they just want to sit in the settings screen of the job and then pretty much that's all they have to do so they can be AFK at that moment so we're just gonna go through here fully upgrade this it's probably gonna look hideous but who cares alright we're doing this to make money so let's hope it does work <laughs> Loop horn, make sure the San Andreas loop, that gives you awesome resale. Um, you know, I don't think color doesn't matter. Sure, we'll do the sun strip, dash, fully loaded, dials. Sure. This is gonna be thugged out. Let's see. Oh, did that, okay. Lights, sure. Neon, sure. There it is. Alright, livery, I don't think that matters, but sure we'll put one on. Plates doesn't matter, respray doesn't matter. Roof, sure. Forward. Funny thing is that actually doesn't look too bad so far. <laughs> Alright, so we're almost done here. Wheels, wheel type. Uh, let's put some Benny's wheels on here. Sure. Let's put these big gold ones on. Why not? <clears throat> All right. Tires. Sure. All right. So once we have it fully upgraded, we're going to just sit in the screen here. So when we go to the exit to office screen, and we're going to hit options, and we're going to go over to friends, and we're going to want to join the friend that is sitting now in the job uh, lobby. Okay, so we're going to go click on that friend, click join game. So it's going to say, are you sure? Hit alert. Should give us an error. Yep, alert. Um, so it's going to return us back. Now, if all worked, we should see two of these in the garage. Oh, boom. Okay, yeah, we see two. I don't know why we're in first person, but all right. So you see the one there? It's all glitched out. And then we have another white one sitting right here as well. So that's good. Okay, so it's actually worked so far. So what we want to do is go over to our blue circle here. And we're going to swap the retro with the other one. Uh, let's try that. Okay, there we go. It duplicates. Now we've got one sitting on top of the other for some reason. All right, so from this point here, what we're supposed to do is get into another one of the elegies. So not one of the ones that are there, but we're going to get into another one. So let's get into this one here. Uh, okay, so with duplication, move the original car, now get to the elevator and select, oh, no, we got to select the elevator first. All right, so, oops, let's go back over here before we do that. Uh, all right, so yeah, again, I'm doing this for the first time. Okay, so you go to the elevator, you want to select the garage that you're personally standing in right now. Um, so I think I'm in garage three. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Yes, I'm in garage three. Okay, pretty sure guess we'll find out here in a second okay and then once we've done that yeah good okay so we'll just spawn back into the garage that we're in so now we want to once we've done that we want to get into the normal elegy into a normal elegy sorry okay 
So we're going to take this into Los Santos Customs. So we're going to hit right on the D-pad to modify it. Um, or not LSC, but you know what I mean, the mod shop that's in your office. Go on to modify it. Um, and then basically from here, we're going to back out. So we don't need to do anything to the LG. We're just going to back out. And then we're going to go over and get into the strange duplicated one. So that looks like that's the one underneath this other car right now. <laughs> so let's hope it lets us in. All right, perfect. Now from here, we're going to hit modify on this one. And we're just going to change the license plate. All right, so same kind of as old glitches. So we're just going to repair it. And we're going to go down to plates. And I can't see because i got an invitation right now. License, and let's just change it to one of those ones. Okay. So once we've done that, we just need to exit, and that's it. So that's basically it for the glitch. So we'll just continue to do this over and over, so let's see if this works. All right, so we've got the two elegies there, Retro Custom. So our friend is still sitting in that job session. Basically what it does is it just kind of glitches us out. So there you go, Elegy Retro Custom, Elegy Retro Custom. Okay, so from here it just says we need to... Um, repeat the steps over again. So we're going to get back into a regular elegy and we're going to pull this into Los Santos Customs or our mod shop again. Alright, so we're going to pull it back in here. So right on the D-pad. Okay, and then from here we're just going to back out. Now what do you need? Okay. So it just says repeat steps 8 and 9 over. So we're in the normal energy now, and then we're going to back out. Okay, and then from here, we're going to get into the strange duplication. So I don't know if it duplicated it again yet. No, not yet. Okay, well, we got into that one. We're going to get into the strange one. I have a feeling we have to swap these again first, though. Wouldn't we have to swap these again? Let's try that. Otherwise, the duplicate's not going to show up. Okay, so we've got that. This is the... Oh no, okay, so that one's showing up as a custom now. Ah. So let's swap that. With that. Alright, there we go. We have another one. Okay, perfect. So, we've now duplicated again. So let's get back into another one. Pull it into the mod shop. All right, I see what happens here. So that first one is actually all glitched out. It's still showing as a regular LG. So that one's not actually going to swap by the looks of it. All right, so we're going to come in here. We're going to exit. All right, that's cool. So the nice thing is you can just do this back to back. We're not going to have to, um, you know, have our friend do this all over again. So we're going to get back into the glitched out one. All right. And we're going to pull it into our mod shop. Let's change the license plate. Alright, so let's repair. Go down to plates. Oh, I hate these notification screens. Can never see what I'm just doing. Alright, we're going to change the plate again. And exit back to the garage. Alright, so now we should technically have three. So let's see what happened. Boom, glitched out. Alright, so we have these three here. Now let's go back over to our blue circle and see what it says. Boom, one, two, three. All right, so now this one's showing as one. So now let's take this one and swap it. Boom, we got another one. All right, this is pretty easy, guys, not too bad. So now we'll get into a regular elegy again. Take it in, back it out. Take back that glitched out one, change the plate, rinse and repeat. So pretty simple. All right, so let's do this. Uh, we'll fill up my garage here, and then we'll see what these bad boys sell for. All right, so we're just going to back out of here now with the stock elegy. So a couple key points. I did try this before with an elegy, like I said, that was already fully customized. It didn't work. So the process is you do have to fully customize it at the time. So it'll kind of glitch out like this. So that's the key. All right. Also does have to be a private session. I tried it in a public lobby first. It didn't work in a public lobby. And you need your friend. All right. So get a friend that uh, also needs money. This way that you guys can help each other out so you can do it. And then once you've done it, 
Uh, you can switch roles and help your friend do it as well. All right. So work together on this. We're going to change the plate, like I said. And then we should come down here. And there we go. So now it's uh, stuck. So we've got this one should be showing up as another Elegy Retro. So let's have a look. Yeah, there we go. See, so the black one that's there is actually showing up as a Retro Custom. So now we're going to take that one that says it's a custom, it's not, swap it with a stock one, boom, there we go. All right, so now we've already got four of them, just like that. So we're going to go over here and get back into the stock one, pull in an LSC, back out, and then change the plate on the glitched one once again. And we are all done. All right, so I'm just going to do this, and then we'll see how much the one sells for once I pull the plate in. Let's see if it gives me a sell price. We know how much we're getting for these bad boys. All right, so we're going to get out of here. We'll get back over to the glitched one here. And right on the D-pad, I'm going to change the plate. What are we doing today? All right, so let's go down. Well, let's change the plate first just to make sure. Okay, so we'll put that one on. Now let's see what this guy sells for, if it'll let us sell this one. Oh, no, not going to let us sell this one. So we will have to do it with the actual, because this one's the glitched out one, so it's not going to give us a sell price. So we'll have to pull one in afterwards and see what we're getting for these guys. All right, so that's glitched out. This is awesome. I know we could count on Tudo to find something as soon as possible with this new uh, DLC that came out. So there we go. So we've got our LG Retro Custom there that's still showing as a stock one. We're going to go swap it with one up here on the second floor now. And boom. All right. Perfect. So now we're going to get back into this guy. And pull it in, back it out. And we're good to go. All right, so I'm going to skip ahead here, guys. I'll show you another little clip here, uh, what they sell for once I'm done duplicating. But you've already seen me duplicate five, so there's not really a point of continuing on with this. So hope this helps you guys out. Uh, drop a like, subscribe if you're new. We'd really appreciate it. Uh, I try to keep you updated with all the latest and greatest GTA content. Just kidding, man. Um, but, of course, I try to keep you guys updated with um, you know duplication glitches as they come along. And, you know, as I like to play around with my mod menus as well. So, again, if you guys need a modded account, hit me up. You can reach me on Kick, Twitter, uh, Instagram, any of the above, Gmail, whatever's easier for you guys. So, hit me up. I've only got a couple accounts left ready right now for transfer, um, but I will have some more coming up here as well. So, um, hit me up for those. All right. So, what am I doing here? I'm changing the plate. All right. So, we'll skip ahead and uh, I'll show you what these guys sell for. All right guys, so once you've done all your dupes, all you need to do is go up into your office and go back to the garage that you were doing the duplicates in, and that car that was glitched out will disappear, so all your cars will show up as normal, so you'll have a garage full of duplicates. So I did 18 of them um, in 20 minutes, so works really quick. Um, even if your friend, my friend actually lagged out, and it still worked. So once you're in that glitch state, I think your friend can pretty much just leave the job. All right, so we're gonna go in here to sell and see what they sell for. I've reached my daily limit. Are you effing kidding me? Seriously? I haven't sold a car yet today. All right, well, I guess I'll have to keep, uh, stay tuned for that. But um, anyways, guys, enjoy uh, duplicating your cars. If you have any questions, drop them below. Again, big shout out to Tudo Facile France for finding this glitch. I uh, really appreciate it, brother. You're always on top of these. So drop a like, subscribe if you are new. And again, hit me up if you are interested in a modded account. If you wish to do it yourself, feel free to check out my tutorial videos that I've posted previously as well. All right, guys. Stella Crew out.